I'll be showing you step by step how to change the title size of your Shopify Dawn theme. So let's not waste any time here and get right into it. So in your Shopify store, you want to navigate to online store on the left hand side and it's going to be under your themes and this is going to open up automatically. And what I'll be doing is giving you a custom piece of code that we'll write out together so you get complete customization control on your Shopify Dawn titles. And we're going to do so without adjusting anything else. If you go to the regular settings section and you go to increase or decrease the heading size, it's going to apply to all headings here, but we only want this to apply to titles. So once you're in the Shopify theme section, what I want you to do next is create a copy of the current theme. I'm always going to recommend this as if you make any mistakes along the way, it's so much easier to restore an older version of the theme. So under these three dots, you're going to click those there and then you're going to click on duplicate. This is going to create an exact copy of your current Dawn theme. So if you make any mistakes, you can easily just publish the previous version as the current version and you don't have to go and figure out what you did wrong. What I'm also going to do now is open up my Shopify store under view your store. This will open things up in a new tab. And the reason why I want to do this is we can see what the titles look like already. If I click into the collection page here, I can currently see our title and I want to increase this font size. Now with this code, you get the customization to either increase or decrease it. It's going to be up to you here. So to go and actually add that code in, let's navigate to our Shopify themes again. I'm going to click on those three dots under our current theme. I'm going to go to the edit code option. This will open up our theme code editor and here we can access quite a few files. Specifically, we're going to be looking for a file called base.css. Let's go and find that together here. So in the top left hand side, search for base.css and underneath the assets folder, we should see the base.css file. So I'm going to click on it to open it up and I want to add our custom piece of code here at the very bottom. So I'm going to drag the slider all the way down here I'm going to create some room at the bottom of the sheet. I'm also going to go and zoom in here so you can copy along with me and you can easily see what I'm doing. This will just take a few lines. So specifically, I'm looking to edit the collection titles. So I'm going to write dot collection dash hero underscore underscore title. Now to note, you can change any title here. But you just need to find the class name. So if I go into my Shopify theme quickly and I right click on all and I click inspect, this will open this up at the bottom here and I can see the section highlighted is collection dash hero underscore underscore title. And that's the one I'm looking to edit. So it's just a quick note there if you want to customize other titles in your Shopify store. I also have a video covering how to edit the product title. So make sure you check that out if that's exactly what you're looking for. So navigating back to my code editor in my other tab here, let's finish this piece of code. So when I write left curly bracket, it should automatically place a right curly bracket, which is our closing tag. And here we're going to add our font size adjustment. So it's going to be font dash size. We can see it's automatically preloading. So I'm going to click on it just to finalize it. You don't have to do that. I'm going to click on semicolon and then I'm going to write my font size in. And this might take some experimentation here on changing it, but for now I'm going to change it to 40 pixels as I was looking to increase the size. And we'll also need a we'll also need a closing double hyphen here just to close everything off. And once you're done, click save in the top right here and feel free to pause the video. You can copy this code as unfortunately I'm unable to paste this in the YouTube description. So next let's go back to my page. And I've already reloaded it and we can see that the font size has been increased drastically. So if you want to decrease the size, you can fiddle with the pixel number here. So currently it's at 70, maybe you want it to go higher to 90. And if you just change this a few times and reload the page, I'm sure you'll be able to find the exact font size and appearance you're looking for. Again, you may want to change the font size of something like the product title. If we go and right click on this element here, so this is the product title itself, this is going to open up our code editor. I'm going to right click here so we can see our product title and we can see the class for this is product underscore underscore title. So you can add some more code. If I just went and changed this here, I'm just going to paste this in. I'm also going to add an H1 next to it as if we go to our inspect element again. 
we can see it's the product title and there is an h1 tag that is also encased in so if i hit save and i go to reload my page which i've already done we can see the font size is just gigantic now so we probably wouldn't want it to be that big but that's overall how we customize the titles in our shopify done theme and we do so by adding a custom bit of css here if you've ever generated any sales on shopify you know how hard it is to keep track of how much money your store has actually made there's your ad spend your cost of goods sold your transaction action fees, your Shopify app fees. There's a ton of different costs that go into running an e-commerce store. That's where our sponsor profit calc comes in. It's the one click profit calculator available for your Shopify store. All you have to do is select the date range you're looking for to get real time calculations so you can see how profitable you are in just one click. It's going to include all your detailed metrics that you need, as well as many different cost of goods sold options, and it syncs seamlessly with all your different ad accounts from Facebook, Google, Snapchat, Pinterest, and TikTok, as well as Bing, so you can get all of your costs into one place. There's a 15-day free trial, so you can test drive everything out for yourself, and there's a link in the description below to access the Shopify app listing. You can also find it in the Shopify app store by searching Profit Calc and looking for this logo in the top left here. So hopefully this video helped and you can now change the title size of just about anything in your Shopify Dawn theme. If you enjoyed this video, I would love it so much if you smash that like and subscribe button below. If you have any questions, leave a comment, but thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.